Hello everybody, I'm playing today the deck that I chose for decks of the weekend and uh, it's crazy, it's really a deck that I didn't expect to see first place in the Modern Challenge, but here we are Gorious Vengeance back at, uh, yeah, back in Modern there used to be a time where Gracial Brand uh, used to be a thing of course you had a uh, Sim Spirit Guide has every unfair deck in Modern for a long time, but now that card is no more there, but you have another one. It's a Traxa, so instead of reanimating Grizzle Brand, you reanimate a Traxa, as you don't win in the same turn, but you just uh, accrue values so that you can go off again and maybe reanimate Emrakul. Emrakul shuffles the graveyard, but it actually it's not like as clean as a... A uh, Blasted Colossus or a uh, World Spine Worm, it goes on the stock. All the Eldrazi go on the stock, so you're able to reanimate it. So, yeah, you put it in the graveyard, triggers go on the stock, you reanimate it, and then you shuffle your graveyard. Uh, that's the. that's And Emrakul is not there anymore. Uh, that's the kind of the way that Gore's Vengeance and in Legacy you have uh, the other card called Shallow Grave to play around it. Uh, we have also the Asmo Package. The deck is Mono Black. I'm excited to try this deck out. I'm almost, almost excited for Through the Breach. I think it's a great B plan as uh, you are able to uh, dodge the. You're able to dodge the uh, Graveyard Hate thanks to Through the Breach and put Emrakul into play that way. I'm not sure how you're able to dodge because like through the breach i guess through the breach emrakul does win the game your opponent usually takes five damage in modern one way or another all right vamos v baker we are beginning here again says my companion Yeah, we don't lose to mill all right for i guess they can always a uh, surgical one and then and then uh, Alright, this is a good hand, let's keep it. Uh, I think I'll bottom this one. Ooh. Spice Lord! How's the... How's the Yurikin going, Spice Lord? Told me yesterday you had uh, problems there. Hopefully, all good now. Thank you for the sub, welcome. You... Wait, you have a RCQ Legacy? Is that what I understood? Did I understood correctly? Is that even a thing? Alright, so opponent's playing uh, this deck. Okay. Um, mm -mm. I'll take the Ingenious Myth. Mmm, modern but with Kiki Jiki, okay, because you said it's Flynn or Twin, so. I am Pitts. Ooh, 213 month sub this morning. Welcome, welcome. Thank you so much. Alright, I'll uh, turn to Profane. Uh... <laughs> Ornithop, there you go, sure thing. I'll turn to uh, Profane Tutor. Turn three, Blood Fountain. Turn four, Emrakul attack. That's the plan here. That is the plan here. Auto Spear. Can you equip? All good. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, it's Flinter Twin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so this goes to one. Let's see if I draw a land. I do. I think I still want to go Blood Fountain, though. I think I just need to go Blood Fountain Pass here. Next turn I grab the Gorio with this, one mana to discard Emrakul, two mana to reanimate it. Yep. This is the way it's supposed to be. They can portable hold the blood. They can, yeah, that's true. I don't know, I'm gonna... 
Wow, are you actually doing it? No, I, it's... What What are you taking there? Oh, thank God, I think the blood fountain. <laughs> okay, I take five down to... Uh, can I die here? As I got seven, eh. Oh, boy, stop playing things. Oh, no. Actually, I might be dead on board after the Emrakul attack. I told you that Emrakul is not good enough. Okay, he moves the prototype. All right. Um, I guess I'm just untapping and drawing. I might draw land that's not a... That's not a fetch land. Okay, so let's grab the Goria. Oh, nice. A swamp. Okay, so let's go swamp. This card. And reanimate it. Okay. Draw a card. Attack. Actually, I play Osmo here. Yeah, I play Osmo here because I discarded a card. So I get a blocker. Yeah, YGO is true. Actually, let me double check my mana base. Let a second swarm. Please tell me yes. Nice, F4. That's good. Okay. Okay, so you have a 13. And then I got a 6. And I'll play an Osmo. Alright, and then Emrakul dies. And I... Actually, goes to the exile. No, it goes to the graveyard. I don't remember. Magical now will tell me. But yeah, it goes to the exile. Adios, Emrakul. There's a saga. <laughs> We're replaying here. It's a game. I think I'd rather go to go to one here. I try to go to one here. I can play thought. I can't. All right. So um, I think I'll uh, start with uh, discarding the thought season. What I draw? Bone charge. Good. Let's do it. Um, cast an additional cost to discard a card. Alright, let's go. I have to hope now my opponent doesn't uh, draw land or I can lose to this saga. The Rocker. Do, 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 do. Buongiorno, the broker. Well, I had a very loud. Uh... All right, opponent, please don't draw land for me. Woo, they don't. Sears Anthon. Good morning, guys. Thank you so much. The broker, eight months and four months. It's a long time support. Thank you, thank you. I think I'll make a. Um, I think I'll make a. Um, yeah. Make a food end of turn. Oh, that's bad. <laughs> okay. Yeah, hey, thank, thank God. Like, look at this game. I put attack. I attacked with Emrakul, and I'm a one life. And I had to hope I wouldn't draw land there, or I would have lost. 
Oh, remember about Giganta? I did not. Thank you so much, Yu. Thank you so much. I I will. I will next turn. Be careful of Ginger Brute. Well, now I can gain life. Those two years of magic will be exciting for you. Nice. Yeah, Bone Splinters. But Bone Shards is the best Bone Splinters for sure. Hmm. You wanna... Um, sure. You wanna hit my graveyard, you can do it. I have two cards in end, four artifacts. End of turn, I'll discard this as well. On top, draw. I'll kill this construct. Return Giganta. Now it's for three. I could have reanimated Giganta. I, I could have won the game if I returned Giganta last turn. Because I just and I guess they had lantern, never mind. But I could have reanimated Giganta with Gloria because Giganta is a legend. That's pretty funny, but I'm sure it's gonna come up. Like it could have come up this game if I win didn't have a lantern. For real though wait, what's this now? This will die to the Asmo. <laughs> uh, this card a card. What is the low first game? Well, we did... We did get the job done here. Slowly. I guess I could still die. I don't know. I've never seen that card before. Me neither. Unctus. It's not a great name. Not a great name, I have to say. I've seen you've seen every card. It must be. I mean, if you draft, you probably see every card, right? Play everything. Opponent, or you did. You can't play Thought Monitor. Good morning, Vinicius. You draw a card. Tutta la vita. Opponent does not die. Should I crack this blood fountain? I think so, right? Yeah, I think so. Play everything. I think at lethal. I'd get there. Discard a card, make a food. Play Asmo. Choose the old one. Fetch up a Underworld cookbook. Play it. Eight attacks. Yes. Tap. Woo! We won the first game! It took a while. It took a while. We attacked the Emrakul and then went on turn 9, but we got there. Alright, playing against the one and only Affinity. Affinity. Do, do, do. Is this time for the B plan? Because they have Lantern and there's a Saga and Tutto Cucuzzaro. Maybe even this. I think I hate this curse spell. The, the biggest problem is, is the land here.
Blue shard? No, I've been it. Brain stonks. Come on. I hate, I hate brain stonks. I have to say, I have to admit, this card is sneak into the deck. I didn't even notice. It was so sneaky. It was sneaky sneaky. Alright, let's go. Hot out push. Mm, maybe. Alright, first stand is bound to have no lands. Is it track suspense on you? It is. I own one and borrow three for this for this morning stream. Alright, keep this hand. What's the worst that can happen? What if I bought him one of those? No, it's my discard outlet. I bought him a saga. Uh, yeah, alright, how can you say no to the brain stonk face? The brain stonk. Ooh. Profane tutor. Hello. Land. Cookbook. Let's hope my opponent doesn't go. Sa. If they go Saga, does their pop off before my profane tutor? No. Hmm. Erox Sun. A lot of eight months are today. What happened eight months ago? That all these people subbed eight months ago. What what month was eight months ago? It's too difficult calculation. I'm not ready for it. But thank you so much, Theok Sucks. <sighs> Chad, I don't know if you know about this, but Later this afternoon, I'll play against the one and only LSV in Legacy on stream. I'm afraid because like er I don't, I'm so tired, everything hurt. But I need to be in shape for later today. Yeah, I'll play against LSV in Legacy. We're gonna just battle three matches and record for CFB. LSV is my hero. And that's a that's a great hero to have for sure. Mine is Ray Duke, always been. A question, my modern power rankings, so Teoxan is supposed to come out this week, yes. I'll find time. This week, my, up, it's, I know it's the last day of February. I, I didn't slack. It was scheduled for today, but today I'm playing against LSV, so I'll uh, delay it to tomorrow. Tomorrow I'll write the article and the video, then the editors will publish it in the next day, for sure. What time are we playing? 4 p.m. European. 4 p.m. European. It's in... Uh, it's too difficult calculation, but it is happening in... I would say 6 hours, 7 hours. Attenzione, pithy needle. Attenzione, this is not bad. For sure. E guarda, facciamo ok. This really is not bad. I'll just go land go. Opponent uh, takes... I don't know why, but I have a feeling I'm gonna lose this game regardless of my glorious vengeance. If the opponent gets a lantern, we can needle the lantern. I could also pity needle the saga, but then I would have lost the lantern. No. No. They named the cookbook. Oh, porca paletta. Oh, porca paletta. The Lantern Natural. Yeah, yeah, everyone might, but as you can see, as you can see, time is running out. As a famous song once said, time is running out. 
I'll fetch down to seven. Take the construct. Upkeep. Don't want to pay the tax. Oh, no. Yes. I probably will pay the tax, yes. I get gory, right? Is there terminus? I think I have to get gory. And with this one, I get hey, white might. And it retracts that for sure. Pitting needle on the lantern. Da, 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 da. Soul guide lantern. All right, we are battling here. He would might seen some must have in this side of X for real though. Like this card is so good, it's so good, such a great addition to the saga X. I can currently manage the board state, but if of course if opponent has like any any additional interaction, I can't I can't do anything about it. But if they don't do anything anymore, we're good. Adesso che cazzo fa sta roba? I don't have to do plus one plus one. Mm. Poi? Other blue creatures you can show the news is just to draw a card. Alright. Talk chorus. And then Twitter creature control becomes a blue artifact. Wow. Wow. So who's gonna draw this card four times? They have four instances of drawing this card here. Or am I dead on board? Oh wow, I'm actually dead on board. Oh no 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 never mind, I gained two life. Okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Piquante. Tutti quanti. Unfortunately, though, I have to chum block with the construct. I wish I didn't have to, but I have to. It's not just that the rock, they also uh, pump their team. They also pump their team. Blue artifact became so. Uh, the Smith got plus one plus one. No! Va bene, basta, basta così. Good game, opponent, you got me. W Baker gets the W. I mean, if a point is so aggressive, the throw to bridge is bad, but I don't know. Hopefully, they're not this aggressive on the play. <laughs> but in it, let's go. Would you have to play first? Yes. Jaggy. Okay. Hmm. You have a sentinel? No. Ooh, that's the owner. I think I'm still doing the profane tutor because the earlier you play this, the better. But I can kill the drum and get back to fetch land there. That's not bad. Uh, 
Uh, um. Turn to fetch land. Play to fetch land. Pass to you. Why did I concede? Is that we're going to kill my needle and then uh, have Solga Lantern open? His opponent don't interact with me at all. No, my profane tutor. Man, this deck needs everything to go right to win a match. Uh. -oh. Sedge. Sedge Mango. The one card they don't want to see? Well, there's a lot of cards they don't want to see. The heroes out of them. Adios, Profane Tutor. Once again, suspend card. Not good to suspend. Only good to cascade. Mellow, hey, <laughs> celebrating Mellow Sub with a fresh Emrakul, the Eon Storm off the top in the only turn I had before Lantern comes down. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. It did not, uh, did not go well. It did not go well. Turns out if you draw three attracts at one Emerald Cool and you don't play show and tell, you don't want to draw them. Do these and Ticho tournament have any significance for real tournaments? Yeah, I would say so. They're made by real people that pay $30 and have to purchase the cards or pay 50 or 60 euro per month to get the cards. So they have a significance, yes. I would say they have the same significance as a RCQ of the same amount of people. I would say the uh, the the name of the tournament uh, doesn't really matter that much online. It's mostly, I think, how many rounds, how many people did they have. Like, if it's 400 people plus or 60, you know what I mean? Like, it's obviously, you need to win, like, two or three, three rounds more. Like going 10-0 with this, like the person that won the challenge, I think they went 7-0 and 3-0 because they won the, the top 8 as well. So they lost zero matches with this. I mean, obviously this deck is a, a lot of variance with it, but still, it definitely means that it's a functional deck and not just a meme, as one would think when you read the deck list. I think the first uh, tough match, like my opponent had main deck lantern, Teferi, probably also counter spells, and so on. All right, let's go Dryad. Am I still playing MTGA? No, I haven't. I haven't. Uh, I haven't opened it in. Um, I don't know a long time. I was. Uh, I was afraid that uh, the RC being standard would have made me open arena, but it did not happen. Thankfully. No arena was open in the process. I'm gonna go turn one thoughtsies. Yeah, it looks to me like exactly they had. I don't think it matters though. Actually, they can't play Pact because they don't have a mana to pay the Dryad. Mm, I'm just gonna discard Dryad here. I think this is the best card in their end. I mean, they still have Summoner's Pact. I have Asmo to kill the Dryad. Imagine they go summon a Spock for Dryad, play two lands to pay the Pact, we just Asmo the Dryad and we win the game. I guess I can't Asmo the Dryad next turn. It needs to be the turn after. Your MTG account is lost. I'm sure you can apply some requests. 
but I, I, I've, I've never had anything similar to my account. All right, as always, I like to suspend the profane tutor ASAP. Jim Davis raid incoming, sweet. Well, we'll welcome him. Hello, Primo. Woo, Jim Davis. Thank you so much for the raid. Welcome, raiders. We are playing uh, Asmo Atraxa Gorious Vengeance, a crazy deck that won the challenge on Sunday. I'm excited to try it. Hopefully, your viewers will enjoy it. Thank you so much, Divium, for the second month. Pretty rare you get to raid me. Yeah, you finished your stream pretty late today. What did you do? Our opponent, Boris Gare, is in the back, a Cavern of Sauce. Like, look at the amulet. You just take one piece away. You know the meme of the astronauts? This little thing is gonna cost us a lot of time. That's that's exactly amulet. You just take one little piece away and it just takes so long for them to, to you know, return to where it was. So amulet is a great deck as long as you don't interact with it. But as long as you do, it is, uh, yeah. Fish bronze to mythic. Ooh. Nice. Alright, let's let's just uh, spam these guys. Now I have two food, meaning that uh, if my opponent casts one of those, Asmo's ready to kill it. The Mikosynth Garden, so put in can copy the amulet. Alright, Profane Tutor. Now, what do I do with the tutor? Because I am missing uh, both the creature and the Gorio. So, it's not that I have Gorio and a tutor up a creature, or vice versa. Mamma mia, why did you make. Why did you write that message? That's sad that a person would do such a thing on the internet. Hmm, what would I get here? Maybe more thoughts. Maybe a saga. Maybe Saga, actually. Let's get Saga, shall we? You wanna go Brain Stonks? No, 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 no. Sorry, but I can't. I can't get a Brain Stonk. I got a brainstorm eventually with Saga. We got food for days. This construct is very large, very large. Insane good, good morning. That's okay, that's okay. Good morning, good morning. So now, 
You play Cavern of Sauce. You name Dryad and you pass again. I mean... I think it's lethal, right? Yeah. It's gonna be a 15. Emperor cool. I mean, the construct is as big as an Emperor cool here. I just, I just wanted to make it fifteen, fifteen. The better fifteen fifteen chat. Who's the best fifteen fifteen in magic? Construct token or Emrakul Dion Storm? Alright, we won the solitary. Let's see if my opponent will be able to interact with me game two. Let's go. World Spine Worm. What's the name of the Rakdos card in my hand? Asbrano Barkani Kadais in Arkulda car. I want I, I remember the name of this card uh, very early when it got spoiled. I learned it by heart. Yeah, this deck is hot when your opponent does literally nothing the whole game and you solitary your way after tutoring an Urza Saga with, uh, where is it, Profane Tutor. <laughs> you think Asmo was first mentioned in Ice Age? No, it's first mentioned in um, Alphabet Unlimited. I can give you a proof in my Unlimited collection in here. Wait a second. Wait a second, eccolo qua, guarda lì ragazzi, guarda lì, so you have the card, Granite Gargoyle, you see, you see the, the end row, the last row, it says Asmorado Marcadi Cadassi in Arcula card, it's a flavor text of it, it says, um, while most overworld, Overworlders, I don't know what that means. Fortunately, don't realize this. Gargoyles can be more can be the most delicious, providing man, I don't know how to read. Allora, let me aspetta that. Why are most over also what does it mean? Overworlders. Oh, other oh, oh, okay, just like at the other side of the world. I understand. Well, most overworlders fortunately don't realize this. Gargoyles can be the most delicious, providing you have the appropriate tools to carve them. So, carve them? Yeah. You meant cook them? Oh, I understand. Asma lives in the underworld. We have our classic zero landers hand, which is a usual of every hand. Okay, this hand is functional. Actually, pretty good. What does the car say about Asmo, though? It's the the flavor text. This this flavor text was made by Asmo. Like you know, you have the quote. The person was Asmo who quoted this granite gargoyle. Babine, let's keep um, I'll take down a land here. Go. Urdaz Sagra. Ooh, Whistleblown Command. That's very good. 
This can kill the the amulet. Atraxa. Tick, tick. Mill three and kill omelet. Uh, I guess I can take a land. Sorry, a swamp, I meant to say. It was not a combo deck, I would have uh, suspended Profane Tutor. I could die here, but I don't. I could die here, but I don't. What if I suck this blood? Or do I want to play Profane Tutor? Hmm. I think I'll suck this blood for a Traxa. I want to get uh, I want to get Asmo in play it's not this turn but the next one I'm able to have two food I guess I could have also added this turn if I just started with the cookbook mm, yeah maybe it was better because I could have had two food already this turn but at the same time there could have been a gory on top of my deck Or a Thoughtseize, you know? Discard a Blood Crypt? Is this another solitary game? Or will the opponent ever interact with us? Who knows? I don't think I want to play another cookbook here. I'd rather discard it. Oh, no, there's nothing. Odin decided, today, Mengu, you will play by yourself. Mm -hmm. Let's return to Gantha. Hello, Tashi. Ooh, Avala kids. The Blood Fountain uh, reanimate, uh, raised dead uh, two cards from your graveyard to your hand. I guess I could have raised dead Yeh or Might. Nah. Yeah, today I'll battle uh, LSV. I'll play three decks. I'll play. I'll play Mono Blue 8 cast, Mono White Initiative, and um, Safari Breakfast. And he's playing uh, Grixis, uh, Delver, Blue Black Shadow, and Blue Red Delver. At the fight. Uh, this Liga lost to Blue White Affinity. I mean, mostly to Teferi and Lantern. Yeah, I like the old border. Yeah. At what time? Soon. Uh, 4 p.m. European. It should be in seven hours. 
All right. Let's go. Land Gloria Diatraxa. Oh, wow, you had endurance. I didn't expect that. They returned two cards from my graveyard. Maybe. Instead of making the construct? Might make sense, because at the end of the day... The construct just dies through this anyway, so... I think I might as well return... These two cards. Wow. Wow! Wow! I didn't notice this! Oh no, this target! Oh, it's not like Glorious Venge. It's not like Shallow Grave. Oh, never mind. Okay then. It targets. Never mind. I thought I I thought I had a huge brain play, but I I didn't. It was it's fine. It's fine. Second pass. Yeah, shallow grave that would have worked because I could have discarded. Oh, 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 that's okay. And pass. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, our mistake. What? What mistake was this? The only mistake here I see is my opponent keep. No, I don't know. Whatever. Maybe they had the endurance. They're like, I need to keep, and they drew, and they drew poorly afterwards. Yeah, graveyard order matters in the shallow grave deck for sure. You're bosejuing the saga. Babin. No constructs for Mangu. No constructs for Mangu. I'll play Jaggy this turn. Jaggy will help me casting a tracks on next turn. I want to kill the... I want to kill the explosives. I want to kill the explosives so that I have two food for my Osmo. And now if they play a Titan, I can kill the... No, you haven't seen Gigantama for ages? Unfortunately, you won't see it again because the opponent conceded it before. Alright, great, great win. It wasn't great win. Okay, chat. Let me take a break. I need to... I need to do some things, my back hurts. So I'll take something for it, and I'll be back in one second. Como vas? Como vas, Tony? Bueno, round number three against Atomic. Atomic. Yeah, Hands suck. I have to mulligan. My hand is also not great, but I am a keeper. I'll bottom a land? Yeah. What if I actually bottom the collective brutality here? Is that Staga to get me the discard toolbox for the Emrakul? Ragaban. Okay, this could be just guy breach. Just guy cards I own.
on into the Traxa. Hopefully they can't cast it. It would be pretty bad if they did. Playing cracks at Sambi Kakei in turn two. <laughs> That's okay. Hoping to find spells. I hope they don't find them. I wish I had my collective brutality instead of lands. Ooh, Blood Fountain. That's pretty good. Can get back the Fury, can get back the Ragavan when he dies. Don't blow with me. Pog. Pepog. What? You killed the Blooming Marsh? <laughs> uh. I just realized that I can channel Bozeju and cast Asmo. You have three lanes. He's been cracking the sun big again. It's turn four. We both have two lanes. It's it's funny. All right. Uh, let's do it. I'll uh, discard a card, get a food token. I'll grab a... Sorry, I'll play Asmo. I'll grab a cookbook. And I'll play it. Finding bolt. Ari did. The blood save mire. Let's go grab a swamp. And let's play another one. Okay. Let's go. Your turn, opponent. Yuri pitching Ragabun. Looking? <laughs> yeah, indeed. I'll discard a cookbook. And I'll kill the Ragabun here. Oh, there's two cards in there, but one should be this one. Oh, the other is Blood Moon. Okay. Oh. I wonder if I should uh, discard as a Traxa. I think actually keeping it for Gigantha. He's real. Best deck in modder right now. You see it right here. Emrakul uh, Atraxa. Best deck in modder. Do I wanna... Do I wanna return? I, th I think I will actually, yeah. I return Osmo. To my hand. Classic. Uh, I think I'm discarding Gamrakul. Adios Graveyard. It's been real.
All my cookbooks are back in the deck. And pass. We're back and we're cooking. Bengasmo is the closest we can get to Menguchi Cuisine stream. Exactly. That's the first time you've seen the second part of cookbook you used? What? No way. You use it all the time. I think this is my second time. Because of I? I have no idea what this card does. The question is now, do I have to read it? Or will it just die without me doing anything? Alright, I guess we'll read it. I mean, first thing first, let's note the picture. This card doesn't have arms, but has swords instead. That's pretty crazy. Plus one, until the turn, a one turn creature attacks a player each combat if able. Hmm. Plus one, this card draw. My die coin plus one, this card draw. My god, my Exalt our creature or given card with mana value less. I mean, it's too small. I can't read it. Sorry. If this will do something badly, I'll blame uh, Magic Online because it's too small. I can't read it. All right, Dragor's Vengeance. Someone could say that was a lucky draw. Ezekete. Is the get the back of the Atraxa Swamp? Man, only three cards I draw. Come on, you're supposed to be better. That's okay. I'll get a profane tutores. Is that it? <laughs> yeah, three cards. Kiss <laughs> Kifo. Alright, done. <sighs> uh, yeah, let's attack uh, Nahiri with this. I don't know what she does, but there's the rule about planeswalkers, that you have to kill planeswalkers. Uh, let's go Swamp. And suspend a profane tutorial. Go. And then Atraxa gets exiled by the gory said to miss on saga right i mean yeah saga was bad though this is blood money play that's what you get for not putting battle right we should put more battle cards in our deck we should put nameless inversion nameless inversion we should put for sure all right i think it's time that we play the best card of our deck no Oh no, 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 I shot, I punted. Oh no, I thought I had five lands. Also, I drew this Goryeo so quick. Oh, never mind, let's just pass. <laughs> so, I went through my. Whoa, arrest me, Angel Avalanche Rider. Cat's opponent. I expect I could, uh, I could Asmo kill the Avalanche Rider. Actually, I'm doing it. I don't want you to. So why? You... Yeah, I don't want you to. Opponente. Tu es muerto. This card. Reanimate. The second the Traxa will do it. Ooh, I can attack with Emrakul as well. That's sweet. Do 
I totally uh, get behind uh, the people that write exclamation mark punt in the chat, but I can't stop thinking. It's always like a little bit sad. I, I don't know. Like, who made it? Like, who's used that? Who's that useful for? This is just, uh, you know, general, uh, a general Twitch thing. Like, who's happy about it? Chat? I mean, it's, I don't know. Obviously, like, I couldn't care less about it, but it's clearly, it happened, like, Um, what am I playing against? Uh, Boar's cards. Mm, Boar's cards. I think I like Through the Breach. Opponent is a classic resting Papega gamer. Like, if I have to think about a person and a deck that plays resting Papega, it's my opponent's deck. So, I will uh, sideboard for it. I think I'll cut a... Uh... I think I'll cut some of the combo for sure. Even though I have through the breach now. I don't know about you, but I hate collective brutality. I think it's just a very weak card. We on, we on Twitch, uh, mostly you watch people to make mistakes. I understand. I understand. I understand. I'm usually turned off by mistake. Sometimes when I watch some streamer and they punt, I, I switch off. Which is why I respect very much the people who remain. After my several mistakes. You're here to laugh at my misery. Wow. I never thought that way. So when my mom asks me what job do I do. It's like the same thing as the people. It's the people uh, running around. Uh, in circus. Are people laughing? Is, is that my job? I never thought about it. I thought my job was to provide interesting content. What am I content about here? I think I'll let brainstorm. Boy, you kept the one lander? Come on! Come on! Die, bro, putana Eva! I think I'm getting a. I'm getting a swamp here. I'll go cookbook. I'll discard uh, bone shards. I'm gonna play Asma. <laughs> Watching Mango say you don't want to quit your job on the spot every day. <laughs> no. Yes. Bold. Opponent is giving. What is giving? I don't know, but they're giving. They're out there giving. I think I'll return Gigantha this turn. Hustle. Go, die, yeah. Oh. Magical line. Okay. Mm. 
Attenzione, di giù la sega land. Vroom vroom. Mm. Hot seas. Am I brain stonking gear? I think I want a brain stonk gear. Sweet. Sweet! Allora, I want a thought seize you. To play top land this turn. I sure don't want to shuffle anything away. Maybe just a cookbook here. Yeah, I'll do like this. So I'll go top land. And I'll go thought seize. And next turn I go, Am I cool the Elm Storm? You can keep anything. You can keep all the cards in your hand. I'll discard uh, this one. Gear is like one mom. Oh, that's true. I didn't think about that. <laughs> I hope you draw land so I, I can play through the bridge without taking three damage. Yeah, lower opponent. Your permanence will all be one. Quoting Pyrexia. Will all be one. This is a sweet combo. I wonder why. I guess Solitude has made it uh, less good these days. Oh no, my graveyard. Oh no, a lightning bolt. Eh, spring! Binding as well. Let's say that uh, our bracket after the first loss uh, got a little bit easy. A little bit easy. But it is a strategy. You lose the first round and then you ease your way through your league. You think this deck was established in the meta? As long as you play against the uh, Amulet Solitary. And Boros cards I own, yes. Our round one opponent was uh, Blue White Affinity. They had a lot of hate for us. They had Lantern, the Fairy, Counters. Yeah, great player lose the first round to have easier opponents in the next round. I mean, the best play will ever be to int intentional draw the first round so you get paired in the control bracket. So, um, this weekend there is Four Seasons, which is a legacy tournament with a lot of casual player, of course. And casual player tend to play control decks. And there's this, like, um, uh, how do you say... Like, if you draw one match, you get put into the draw bracket where it's just 50 control players playing against each other. I swear, it's like that. Like, every time a friend of mine draws in those events, they get, they get only control ma mirror matches. So, the best thing to do is to bring a deck that's good against control, like, I don't know, Mono White Initiative. And then you just intentionally draw the first match. And then you just, I swear, you're going to get paired against nine control decks. I mean, a pro a pro the problem is that you might draw. That's that's the biggest risk because, like, just, like, the casual players are so slow. And, you know, there is no, there is no defense against that.
you play an anti-control the problem of playing an anti-control deck is that you're gonna play against nine control decks you're gonna draw one one more time for sure doesn't matter how, how fast is your deck hello chat this hand is unplayable one of the reasons why i hate decks like this is that you open three lands for spells hand and you mulligan whenever a deck does this i only say that it's a bad deck you just i just because i don't i don't i don't like this style of magic of course of course like i'm with a titan or whatever combo deck can open hands like this and still keeps but yeah i don't i personally don't like to open lands of hands of lands and spells and having to mulligan to me it's a sign of weakness player wants to make the most out of their time therefore play control that's true also casual players just hate to be told to play faster they hate it they would rather just i don't know lose than be told to play faster wow they're going for it crazy have you ever cast the tracks yet i haven't they're going for it the mad man is going for it. Wow, and I chopped the Gorio. But my bella, you cool show. I point I might even have Dotty Void Walker now. And it doesn't do anything. Magic is easy sometimes. <laughs> it really is. I mean, I could have modded into three this game and I would have won. <laughs> when I did the wrong scam. Come on, like doing a fury after I play Blob Crypt. Yeah, that's a. No, a track so it doesn't draw three cards. It's gonna draw four. Does dodge thoughtsies? I mean, I put it didn't have thoughtsies. I mean, I might, I might draw it now. Que fai montagna? I got the dash. All right, don't find thoughtsies from my deck. Can't you pull Oh, oh. Don't find thoughts from my deck. Opponent. Opponent. Don't find thoughts from my deck. Brain stonks. Alright, I take it. Opponent. Mangu. I hate these decks. Mangu wins on turn 3. I know, see? That's a luck deck. I hate luck decks. No, that's not true. I don't hate them. But I don't love them either. Allora, let's play Urza Sagra. Yes. And then let's play Gore's Vengeance. Playing against the scam, I think I'm bringing in push because of the Dotty Wood Walker. Technically, every deck is a luck deck. No. Oh. Mm. I, what's their graveyard? These scam players, they play with Leyland of the Void. So I need uh, Through the Breach. I need Through the Breach. Actually, I might need Collective Brutality. I love to take out Thoughtseize. It's my favorite thing to do. Microphone? Yeah, sometimes I don't know how my microphone reacts to my... to my strange voices. I always hope it sounds good, but it, I, know, I know it doesn't. Yeah, even the opponent didn't want brain stonks. Exactly. I thought you liked Unfair Strategies Mengu. Yeah, but Vintage Cube is not constructed. Vintage Cube is like you do it once in a while and you move on. 
We used to cube way way more often in my town. Now, like everybody left. There's no there's nobody to cube with anymore. Sedge. It cuts when I stream. Oh, really? It cuts when I stream. When I scream. But you'll miss the mango screams. Where did I go? I live in a tourist city and it's very rare to find like a normal job here in the winter. So yeah, people go in other places usually. I uh, turned to Emrakul. <laughs> it's not very good, but it's also not that bad. How often do you get to cube? Um, it really depends. When there's four or six players, we do it. Thought, Seize, or Ragaban? The scam. Our opponent this time, they, 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 they made the good scam this time. I made the good scam this time. <laughs> Woo, look at the cookbook. The cook? Book. I wonder how my opponent doesn't have a blood moon too. Maybe the the saga can raise the grief. Sorry, raise like I don't know double block. Because I'll have a lot of uh, a lot of those tokens with the uh, Overwatch's Daredevil. Thoughts is both confirmed. Oh, it's thoughts and grief. Okay, I got it. Ragaban, hmm. Aloha. Always yes. Always yield. Okay. Something. Is this something? Probably not. Actually, I might get Gorio. In three turn, in two turns, am I dead here? Say, say, do di ci quattro. There's a, there's a chance. So you're saying there's a chance? I can even gain life. We're gonna top the Goria now. Yeah, it would be fun if I top the Goria. Top Kakaba. The Thoughts bug is real when it happens, and it's not real when it doesn't. Opponent non fa matto che fai Blood Moon, eh? Actually, I might even beat Blood Moon here. I might even beat Blood Moon here. We'll see. This happened quite a bit. Yeah, exactly. It happens every time. It happens every time it happens. I don't know. I don't know if you understand what I'm saying. But whenever you pay attention to it, it happens. Whenever it doesn't happen, it's because you didn't pay attention. That's what I'm trying to say. Oh, Belemra cool idiot. Go. It's real when it happens, and it's not real when it doesn't happen. Hashtag Meguchi philosophy. Exactly. That sounds this bug paradox. <laughs> what is struggling over there? They're thinking, what can I do? What can I do?
have a very large construct here. It really is large. It's like a 5-5. Five five. In paper, I could even block grief. No, I can't. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes I read. I mean, uh, you know my joke. Uh, legal in paper. My 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 YouTube comments. It's so funny because every video somebody suggests a play that's illegal, and my YouTube comments are always legal in paper. <laughs> I love it. Why didn't you block the Chirac with your white card? Enjoy. Yeah, yeah, yeah Merkel is coming. And Merkel is coming. Because I have the Propentator suspended at one counter. Any chance we can see playing a Threats of Oath in Vintage at some point? Zero chance, I'm sorry. But uh, today I have a video coming out about Mono White Initiative in, in Vintage. The thought is bug is legal in paper. Yeah, yeah, for sure. When it happens, it's a thought is bug as well. All right, let's block Agaban. Three cards for you. I'm at six. Do you think M2 Turek is too strong for modern? In general, uh, Wizards doesn't like this cards are random cards. I want to say that uh, they definitely thought about adding M2 Turek in modern, and they thought not. Seer. No, they, they didn't think about it at the end and they preferred uh, to play, to print the legend of Turek. I think that's what happened. The constructs did. Long live the construct. What is one card in end? Hmm. Babine. Let's go. Let's go, Mangu. Let's go. Tutor of Goria. Let's grab uh wanna grab a brain stonks here? Yeah, let's grab a brain stonks. Then discard a card and make a food token. I'll discard uh, uh, Emrakul Dion's Thorn. Trigger goes on the stack. And then we Gorio it back. Does it work? Shuffle. Shuffle, shuffle. They said sad face. I'll say happy face. And Nuri Grande wins the match! Alright, chat. We have defeated a Scam Grief turn one. Very good. I'll take a bathroom break and I'll come back for round. Our scams are better. <laughs> That's true. Yes, I'll play in Napoli. Napoli. The future. Football winner, how do you say? Football, uh, football league, Italian football league winner, Naples, Napoli. Final round, we have our sweet, sweet companion. We have our non functional hand. Actually, no, it's not true, this hand is functional. This hand is very functional. One of the most functional I've had have ever had outside of the turn to Emrakul. Alright, keep Shimas. I got turn one? No. 
Really? The mulligan took five. Five. Cinco. What do you do? Tower? Urza's tower? Marsh flats. Is that this, is that a very unlucky scam player? What are they on? Ooh, hammer. Hmm. Who wants to hammer me? I see. They want to hammer me. <sighs> if I play turn one saga, I can go turn three. Nah, sorry, chat. I don't feel it. I don't feel it. I do not feel the turn one saga. Porca merda, moro. I'm about to die. I'm about to die. No. My good eyes. Oh, man, good eyes. Our piece of point be unlucky. Don't have Amber. <laughs> Please, opponent, be unlucky. Don't kill me. They need lane Amber. I mean, yeah. Well, I got two fives, so I probably have it. Pog! They don't have anything! On top draw. Oh, they'll chase their devil. Land. Go. Yeah, Blur Prowess is one of the best decks in modern. I prefer the White Splash, yes. Okay. They drew a land. Ornithopter. And they play. Paladino, okay. Respecta, you had killed me. You killed me there. I guess they're afraid. They're afraid. Opponent. I guess it's fine. Like, I have three lands and tapped. They didn't want to kill me. Makes sense. Sorry? Not sorry. <laughs> Vai, vai. Equipalo tutto. Bluff power, exactly. We even have a Oh, you drew that one, sure. Allora, chat. Uh, look at this, though, because my opponent, uh, they can easily survive a Emrakul attack. No, I wish no, they can't. Because they have to... One second, because they have to block the paladin, they have to block the construct as well. They have to block the construct as well, so yeah, it's good. Uh, what do I grab here with this profane tutor? I think I grab uh, the Boseju. Right? Maybe Brutality. Hmm. I think Brutality might be lethal. Hmm. Is there a way they can interact with me? I don't think so. Book, book. This card. And reanimate. Zagade? Zagade, zagade, zagade. Chakuro. Opponent, yes, I made a Emrakul Dionstorn in Modern, spending two mana. 
This is legal. And you have to sacrifice six permanents now. Or can you fight my cyber guide? Uh, of just get prowess. I posted it on channel Farbo, but you need to have TCG Pro. Americans can get TCG Pro for seven dollars a month, and also get uh, the free shipping and uh, tracking. Bonente. What turn is this kill for? <laughs> One lonely ornithopter in play. Very sad. A very lonely sad ornithopter in play. Okay. Insect. Pushy pushy. With the blue command and throw the breach. Putin has sanctifier in back now. Opponent has Sanctifier and Vecchio. We have an Expedition map as well. This fetches up as a Ju. And do this. I mean, Brutality is good. Pains me to say the brutality is good, but it might be good. Yeah, let's do this. Is this deck new? Yeah. Why did the opponent sacrifice the way they did? I don't know. Not responsible for my opponent play. Plains Esper Sentinella, beautiful card, one of the best in Modern Horizons 2. Would you library? Sagra? Oh, for you missed it. I got a tube. Got the reality cheap kiski for right. land. I think I'll play <coughs> Blood Fountain here. Blood Fountain here. It makes two artifacts so that my construct is larger. All the way from Popper. The Blood Fountain, enabling Frogmites and the uh, Mirror Enforcer. Dude, I'm so glad when it has the reality chip. Oh, you want to attack with Stoneforge? Why is that? Oh, cool. Thank you, deck. Poor Stoneforge didn't deserve. It didn't not deserve what happened. I really have nothing going on here. My hand is uh, 
<ride> non playable. No dead yet. 16. No dead yet. My problem is that Emrakul is not good enough to win, so yeah. Alright, let's quickly go to the round game three. So final game of this league. Let's begin the final game. This hand. This hand. This hand is a turn four thing. And I still my opponent doesn't interact with it at all. Maybe it's good enough. How do they interact? Spell peers? Yeah, you know what? I'm keeping it. Like the fire in Vec doesn't even stop the Emrakul. Oh, the worst push. Okay. Hmm. I go Kaldra. I wonder if I should push the Stoneforge here. Yeah, I think I will. I don't want you to cast Kaldra. My sneak and show video will come out on YouTube channel of Channel Fireball. Usually it's for uh, TCG Pro members, uh, it's up immediately. And for the regular YouTube channel, it goes out uh, one or two weeks after. The run is Magistrate. Oh, wow. I wish I had a final push in my hand. So this one gets countered. That's okay though. Urza Saga will be able to. Urza Saga will be able to get uh, the cookbook. It's the card I was meant to keep companion in check. Exactly. to 15 you have four cards in end mm, the cookbook do we get another cookbook yeah hmm yeah I think so. I can go expedition map. No, 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 cats. Let's go cookbook. Yeah. I'm just doing the thing here. If you have any interaction, I have another Gorious Vengeance. Yeah, so let's uh, discard a card, Emrakul. Let's Gorius back. If you have an interaction, you have spell peers. Eh, niente, ho perso, I lost. I haven't lost yet, of course, but... Draw land, I could have done it again, but... 
I don't know, maybe I should have held held it up. Maybe. But like the thing is that I lose um, I lose mana. No, I think I think I think I had to do. I think I had to do it. I think I had to, to do it. On uh, maybe expedition map, get a land, play with a bloom command, get a land. I think in the long run, I lose that game. Put it in taps, and they might have multiple uh, multiple cards. Yeah, Dranith Magistrate was brutal. Maybe I was not supposed to use the Fatal Push on the first Stone Forge. I just hold it for Dranith. Um. Mm -mm. Let's do top deck here. I think I'm actually attacking. Does this make any sense? I want to put you down to 12 so that if I draw an Emrakul, I win the game. Which one? Bro. Hmm. Not the worst. I can discard Goria. Am I alive here? I think I am alive here. Gargorio. Play Asmo. I'll grab another cookbook. Imagine actually winning this game. You get a four? Did I just randomly, did I just randomly won this game? What you do there? End of turn. March, Diasmo. Um, well, so I need to block the Perection Germ. I guess I can kill the things. This becomes a 4-4. Four, four. I trampled for 1. I think it's good enough. Yeah, I'll kill your things there. I guess I just died to another removal spell. Maybe I was supposed to not make a token, but just gain life. 
blacksmith skill. I think blacksmith skill there. Should I worry about killing that thing? I don't think so, actually. If I kill that thing, probably if you have another one. Attack two food, the construct becomes a 4-4. Four, four. I block the Kaladra, I take one trample. No, I think it's fine. You go. I did not say I didn't show the spear. I'm dead to any removal spell. Or Cigard is 8 or Paladin. Back to chump. Or strike. We'll kill the construct. Okay. Push. Hmm. Um, I can make a construct and block the Caligra. Yeah, I think it's reasonable. Get the might. Act for seven. And pass. Once again to chomp the, the germ. Yeah, their hand is hammer plus a mystery card. If the mystery card is not a blacksmith skill or a spell pierce, I think I win. Back to chomp again. Alright, uh, I think I'll play around spell here, so I'll just untap here. You're up. Yeah, let's go, let's go for lethal here. I'll play push on Drane. What's your mystery card? This black myth skill is annoying. Alright, let's go. What you got? What do you got? You have one, one mystery card. Is it a march? Wow, we won. Crazy that we won this game. Eh? Well, the Gore's Vengeance didn't work. I thought, thought we were dead, but turns out Earth's Saga were, was able to grind this one. Yeah, very sweet. I think it was very important when I attacked from 16 down to 12. That attack really matter when my opponent was attacking me back. I accepted to trade for damage for one there. Yeah, it was, was good.
All right. Well, that's it. We got to the four one. The recipe for a victory. Lose the first round, and then, and then carry through the league. All right, all right. Thank you all for watching. If you watch this on YouTube and appreciate it, subscribe, leave a comment, like the usuals. If you watch it on stream. All right, we're gonna do some more videos now, chat.